Philippians 3.10 That I may know him and the power of his resurrection and the fellowship of his sufferings being made conformable unto his death. The fellowship of his suffering. Very tricky term. The fellowship of his suffering. Because the word suffering is a Greek word pantima. For those of you making notes, P-A-N-T-H-E-M-A, -E pantima, is used 16 times. And Brother Paul used it a lot of times when he says his suffering is a bit technical. His suffering because in Romans chapter 8 verse 18, Brother Paul says that the suffering, our suffering of this present time, our suffering, Romans 8.18, our suffering of this present time are not worthy to be compared with the glory which shall be revealed in us. Then in 2 Corinthians chapter 1 verse 5, 2 Corinthians chapter 1 verse 5, he now says, For as the sufferings of Christ abound in us, the sufferings of Christ abound in us. Which is what we face when we preach the gospel. So it's a bit technical. Again, if you look at Philippians 9, 6 for further study. Philippians 9, 6. Colossians 1, 24 for further study. 2 Timothy chapter 3, verse 11. 2 Timothy chapter 3, verse 11. Obviously, the fellowship of his suffering has twofold meaning. Number one. He shares with me. He coinonias with me on why he suffered. He shares with me. He fellowships with me on why he suffered. Number two, he shares with me the blessedness of suffering for why he suffered. The blessedness of suffering for why he suffered or why he suffered. Number one, he shares with me why he suffered. Number two, he shares with me that blessedness of suffering for why he suffered. And that is what we saw in Matthew chapter 5. Blessed are they that are persecuted for righteousness sake. Blessed are they. So he shares with me the blessedness of suffering for why he suffered. Today, when you are persecuted... People think something is wrong with you. The Christianity of today is such that all believers expect is bread and butter. So once a brother is going through a trial or a sister is going through persecution or a brother is going through a challenge for his faith, they begin to say maybe he has done something wrong. Meanwhile, persecution is in tandem with the gospel. Blessed are they that are persecuted for righteousness sake. 